According to Dexerto, they have revealed that NYPD arrest street racer squeezed Benz after viral neon hit and run. And just to catch everybody else up who didn't see the last video on what happened, here's that clip. Oh my god! Oh, oh my oh. I am not gonna lie, bro. This man's a piece of shit, bro. Because you could have easily gotten somebody killed, injured, like extremely badly, bro. What he did there was extremely. What's up guys, your boy Alien CX. Thank you guys for watching this video. It's your boy back with another video, man. This video is gonna drop directly into this video, bro. This video involves neon. I've not watched it, I don't know shit about it, but we're gonna go. I'm gonna tell you what we gotta do, and we gonna do that shit, my boy. But yeah, let's get into this. Video's by my boy Destiny, man, legend. Uh his name now is different now, but you're gonna see him on the screen. Let's go into this though, and I'm gonna give you guys my opinion, bro. Let's go. And for those of y'all that were that way, amazing the comments, bro. Yo, you guys know who you are in general, bro. Love you guys, bro. You guys are incredible, bro. Some of y'all's faces are gonna be on the screen, but yeah, let's, let's get into this. Let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so it is official. Neon has officially got somebody arrested. Now, I'm sure a lot of you saw my video about Neon with this guy in New York. He was cutting up in traffic, and his name was Squeeze Benz. And, you know, I talked about the entire situation. They were speeding. They got into a car accident. And I was like, bro, if law enforcement actually wanted to catch this guy and find out who he is, they could easily do so by tracing his location via social media tags, IP addresses, cookies, cash, getting a subpoena and requesting that that any social media account that he has with linked personal information be exposed for the investigation like it is incredibly easy and i'm surprised more of these new york based cutting up in traffic dudes aren't getting arrested because like they be out here wilding but yeah as according to dex Erdo, they have revealed that nypd arrest street racer squeeze bends after viral neon hit and run and just to catch everybody else up who didn't see the last video on what happened here's that clip Oh my god. Oh, oh my. Oh. I am not gonna lie, bro. This man's a piece of shit, bro. Because you could have easily gotten somebody killed, injured, like, extremely badly, bro. What he did there was extremely fucked up. I'm not gonna lie. So, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I wanna be a dick, bro, but I'm happy he got caught. I'm happy he got caught. Some people might not be, some people might not be on my side and they might be like, oh my gosh, no. This, this is your favorite speed killing people YouTuber, bro. Come on. For me personally, bro, he's a piece of shit. And mostly when you put people's lives in, dan in danger like that. Because I remember watching a video on a family that literally lost three kids, bro. Three kids to this dumb shit. So fuck no, man. Like, no, man. I'm happy you got arrested. I'm not going to lie, bro. Okay. Well, folks, you saw it here first. After committing multiple felonies with Neon in the passenger seat, this dumbass Lamborghini driver just got rear-ended by his own homie driving the BMW we all saw in the earlier clip, like, bro. And yeah, boy has now been officially arrested. This is him. They say in this post, Queens, New York man arrested for eluding during traffic violations for social media posts. Newark Public Safety Director Fritz G. Frage reports the arrest of Antonio Gentry, 19 of Queens. Queens, New York, for a looting incident that occurred on Thursday, April 11th, 2024. They say at approximately 1.16 a.m. in the morning, police patrolling the area of Broad and Market Street, literally down the street from where I went to high school, observed a black BMW that traveled around their police vehicle at a high rate of speed and had no front or back license plates. The driver also made a turn from Market Street onto Broad Street, although no turn signs are posted at the intersection. Police attempted a motor vehicle stop, but the driver driver disregarded their attempts and continued eluding police at a high rate of speed. The officers did not proceed with a pursuit, but completed an eluding report on the vehicle. Detectives investigating this incident located several videos of Gin Street committing various traffic violations throughout the tri-state area and attempting to antagonize police. One of the videos detectives discovered was the April 11, 2024 incident in Newark involving Gin Street eluding police. Newark detectives coordinated with NYPD auto crime 
Crimes Manhattan Unit to locate Gen Street, who faces a charge of eluding in Newark, among other pending charges from several law enforcement agencies. So clearly, based on everything we just heard, this guy has been a menace all over NYC and Jersey, cutting up in traffic, speeding, and driving away from police officers with no license plates, like he's fucking Batman or some shit. Like, and it's no coincidence that this man has been finally caught after collabing with Neon less than a month ago. Like, bro, even people are saying Neon ratted him out, which I don't know. It's possible. If the feds actually wanted to catch this guy and they knew he collabed with Neon, all they would have to do is go to Neon, bring him in on charges of crimes by proxy, and I'm sure Neon would fold immediately. Like, Neon is not a... I'm not gonna lie, but this, Neon is somebody that does look like somebody that will instantly snitch the hell on your ass, bro. Man probably already has a lot. Probably has a, so much fucking charges on him already in general, bro. So I'm not surprised. For one in general, bro, why... In the living hell, would you like? I mean, I understand people are like, oh my gosh, clout views. I have to get the views. I must get the clout. Like, bro, you already know you already, people already want you to be in jail, which I'm not gonna be wrong, bro. I'm happy this guy got caught. This man was, was a menace. Man has probably gotten a lot more people injured or getting close to being injured and killed. So I'm happy he got caught in general. But hey, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Neon might be the next 6 9 bro. I'm not, I'm happy the man got caught, but I'm not gonna hit on him. Nice job, Neon, if you snitched on this guy. But at the same time, bro, how dumb could you be that you literally got yourself caught that fast, bro? Come on. Come, come on. Like, come here. Come on. You dumb. But yeah. <laughs> All jokes aside, bro, like, I'm... Maybe you got caught. About to spend a couple years in jail or get a fed charge just to be tough, like that little nah, bro. Like, stop playing. But as upon checking, it does seem like his Instagram page is still up and looks like he got a lot more followers recently. And he still has decided to keep the, the viral video that I guess got him locked up still on his page. So, like, it's like the feds know who he is now. The feds understand that he's a menace in traffic, he's making videos marketing his federal crimes, and like, it just seems like he does not give a fuck. Like, this is crazy. Crazy, bro. <laughs> Man, it's just like wow. Street racing has exploded in New York City. Our investigation found that three more month complaints about drag racing in the Bronx will let him in Somebody said, why is it always some dog shit music, bro? <laughs> Somebody said, glad NYPD got you in custody. Somebody said, LOL, that's why y'all should check y'all DMs. I told this not to throw up his Shopify website. That's how he was hit. They linked his Shopify to his personal identity. But yeah, man, it, it's pretty much over for this guy. I mean, like, he did himself dirty, like, bro. Like, bro really thought he was gonna make a come up in front of the feds by trying to monetize federal crimes and thought they were just gonna sit by and let him do what he wanted to do while he raking millions of potential dollars. Like, no, my guy, you're stupid. You're dumb. Like, the social media shit has clearly gone not gonna lie, bro. You dumb as shit, bro. After you got caught, bro. Thank you guys for watching this video. Select the next video, bro. You gotta check out, check out this next video right here on the channel, bro. You know you want to, bro. And this video is it's a little bit more spicy. Got that spicy, dicey to it, bro. And it's me, your boy, Alien CX. You guys know what to do, my boy. And hey, hey, hey. Don't, bro. Don't go, baby. Baby, baby, double. Baby, oh my, I cannot. I'm saying. Don't go fucking speed racing, bro. You're gonna get yourself killed. And get somebody else killed. Peace out.